The U.S. Department of Education will make more than $150 billion in post-secondary financial aid available to students throughout our nation, with the sticker price of the nation's top private universities now topping $200,000 for four years. Financial aid is a must for most students, but if you have ever had to fill out all of those forms, you know that it can be quite tricky. We're taking action for you with help filling out the free application for federal student aid form. It's even long to say. Now, as Brad Davis explains, St. Pete College is hosting some free workshops over the next five weeks to help parents and students with that process. Hitting the books is only the first step to getting into college for most students. And for many, figuring out how to pay for it is the most difficult assignment of all. That's why the Free Application for Student Aid, or FAFSA, is such a crucial first step in securing money. And a free workshop is a way for parents and students to make sure they're filling out the application properly. We're in it really to help families get the, you know, the necessary help that they need to get that form off in the best situation possible to enhance their ability to qualify for as much aid as possible. SPC's Office of Financial Aid will host four free workshops in Pinellas County over the next five weeks. Boca Siega High School will host the first workshop tomorrow night. It's um, immeasurable, immeasurable. Are you kidding me? Parents can actually leave one of these sessions knowing that they've undertaken an enormous task and it's completed? Completing the comprehensive and oftentimes confusing free application is a necessary first step in trying to obtain many different forms of financial aid for college. Even students appreciate the value of the free workshops. I believe they should come because it'll take a lot of pressure and a lot of burdens off of their parents' shoulders. Families who've never gone through that process before is foreign to them, so we help walk them through the process and help to navigate the waters. In Pinellas County, Brad Davis, ABC Action News.